In this video, I will talk about the largest iron mine in Afghanistan and Central Asia. Afghanistan, with the largest and best iron mine in Central Asia, has encountered more than 100 iron mines. These unique reserves are estimated to be worth more than $420 billion, and with high grades of up to 62%, they are recognized as low consumption and top quality mines in Asia. Most importantly, these mines are so rich that it seems to take 180 years to extract iron from them. By examining the Hajigak mine in Bamiyan province and other large mines in Afghanistan, I will introduce you to the hidden world and the great economic potential of Afghanistan. Afghanistan's iron mines are very important in Badakhshan, Panjshir, Gorband, Bamiyan, Hajigak, Besud, Lalsar Jangal, Yakavlang, Gor, Kandahar, Maimene, Herat, Uruzgan, Paktia. Now it has been established in 100 places of iron mines that the total reserves of Afghanistan's iron mines are more than billions of tons with a value of $420 billion. Afghanistan's iron mines generally have a high standard of 4762%, which are among the low consumption and high quality mines in Asia, which are among the rare mines in the world. 100 kilometers north of Kandahar, there is a big iron mine with a capacity of 3 million tons. Also, the iron mine is located 9 kilometers from the city of Jabal al Siraj. The largest iron mines in Central Asia. Hajigak Iron Mine is located in Bamyan Province, 130 kilometers northwest of Kabul. A few kilometers from this mine, there is a huge deposit of lime for smelting iron. After Hajigak, the second iron mine in Afghanistan, parallel to Hajigak, is Sayadarya Iron Mines. A Hangaran mine in Bamyan has up to 65% iron. The third iron mine in Afghanistan that competes with Shadow of the Sea is Dahani Dargushtak Mine, which has 47% iron. The fourth largest iron mine in Afghanistan is Lal Sarjangal, which is in the same row as Hajigak. Hajigak Big Iron Mine of Bamiyan, Afghanistan is located in the heights of Baba Mountains, near Kotel Hajigak, 100 kilometers northwest of Kabul and east of Bamiyan. This mine is considered the largest iron mine in Afghanistan and in the region. This mine was identified in 1911 and has been studied by various geologists. Hajigak mine is 12 kilometers long and 550 meters deep. Exploratory research of this mine has been done. The possible reserve is 1.8 billion tons and the percentage of iron is 62%. For the construction of iron smelting, Several coal mines in the north of Bamyan can be mentioned, such as Dera Suf and Yakavalang coal mines. Quality coal pieces are available in Sighan district and Komar district of Bamyan province in an area of about 80 to 100 kilometers. The Indian government was supposed to invest $14 billion in Hajigak mine. Indian companies had undertaken the construction of the railway from Hajigak mine to Iran's Chabahar port. Hajigak Mine has three large reserves, two of which are owned by an Indian group and the last one by a Canadian company with the Afghan government for the purpose of mining. But unfortunately, this work was not implemented because of the recent wars in Afghanistan. This work was stopped. According to estimates, it will take 180 years to extract all the iron in this mine. Sia Dere Iron Mine is the second largest iron mine in the country after Hajigak Iron Mine. This mine is located 22 kilometers from Bamyan province in Yakvalang district of this province. The evaluations made in this mine show that there are billions of tons of iron and coal in this mine, and it is possible that its reserves are more than Hajigak mine. There is 62% iron in the iron ore composition of the Saya Dare mine, and it is estimated that the main area of this mine covers 30 kilometers. There are chemical elements in the black mine of Yakavalang Valley which are used in the production of high-quality steel. Kandahar Kakriz Iron Mine is located 100 kilometers north of Kandahar City in Kandahar Kakriz District. The research conducted in this mine shows that the capacity of this mine is estimated to be more than 3 million tons of iron. The percentage of copper in the stones of this mine is 61.4% and the rest is iron 
and other metals that have not been specifically identified yet. Sayajar Iron Mine is located in Badakhshan provinces, where the mineral bodies have stratified forms and have a combination of hematite and magnetite. The iron reserves in this mine are estimated to be between 40 and 45 million tons. Formark Iron Mine is located in Badakhshan province, and the iron reserves in this mine are estimated to be 35 million tons. Zirek Iron Mine is located in Baglan province, where three separate clusters of hematite magnetite mineral bodies have been identified. The reserves of this mine are estimated at 20 million tons. Kish Iron Mine is located in Bamyan province. The estimated reserves of this mine are 117 million tons. These mines have not yet been mined, and the value of billions of dollars is buried under the soil. The use of iron mines leads to the creation of job opportunities in the mining and mineral processing industry. This job creation helps to improve people's economic conditions and reduce unemployment. The sale of minerals to foreign markets provides large financial resources for the Afghan government. This national income can be used to develop infrastructure and public services, such as improving road infrastructure and irrigation. The presence of iron mines can lead to the development of the steel industry in Afghanistan. Domestic steel production prevents dependence on foreign steel imports and helps to create a strong industrial infrastructure in Afghanistan. To transport minerals from mines to processing centers and international markets, the need to develop transportation infrastructure, such as railways and ports, is felt. This infrastructure development provides improvement in access to rural areas and the depth of the country. For the optimal exploitation of iron mines, the capabilities of mining experts and the use of advanced technologies and modern equipment are needed. These improvements in the field of education and technology development can have positive effects on society. Obtaining financial resources from iron ore mines will help Afghanistan avoid dependence on a particular economic resource and diversify its economy. Many iron mines are located in rural areas, and their exploitation can promote the development of rural areas and reduce poverty in these areas. Ferrous metals, including steel, are used as main materials in the construction industry. Construction development in Afghanistan requires metal raw materials that iron mines can provide. Afghanistan's iron mines, as a source of rich economic and developmental value, can contribute to the realization of the sustainable development of this country and become fundamental to the improvement of the living conditions of the Afghan people. But it is also very important to pay attention to environmental and social issues in order to minimize the possible negative effects of mining and to take care of the sustainability of Afghanistan's natural resources. Thank you for your attention so far. Please subscribe to this channel. Bye until the next video. Bye.